Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome to The Yogg. The Yogg is a kind of simulation game where you take control of a group of people for a certain span of time, while raising their stats, going through random events, trying not to screw over their lives, and preparing for The Yogg. I think we'll go with... Cocky Prince Dude. And we'll go with you, since your outfit looks pretty similar. The Yogg will be here in six weeks, and no one expects it. Not a one of us. We just keep on living our lives week by week, unaware. Seems I'm controlling this character right now. I think the best thing to do right now is go to the tavern and drink and spend the entire week getting wasted. But we gain two charm and one physique. I think this is a pretty important thing to do when you're preparing for a terrible event to happen. And apparently being drunk and playing darts is not very... good. Ouch. My pride. And... for a few... Let's go to the forest. And hunt. Yes, hunt the defenseless critters. These rabbits won't know what's coming. Some people lost in the woods. Could be bandits. I guess we'll help them. And I'm gonna probably find out they're bandits. <laughs> I don't know how I find my way home at night. I just kind of wander around and I pick a random house and break the door in. They say the last time it came, the Yogg devoured houses whole, stole lives, tore families and family members apart. But that was so very long ago. Let's visit the hospital. Clean up. Tend to patients. We have a bad hangover, but I don't think anything will go wrong. Uh-oh, he's got spiral disease. Oh no. Now I too have the spiral power. Ouch. I might as well become a crazy-ass wizard at this rate. So I don't know if they can visit the same place or not. We'll try that afterwards. Compete and fight, or bet on fight. Your giant trident is no match for my little ass dagger. Oh. I apparently I'm not the chosen one either. It was on us in a heartbeat, or so the stories go. The earth shook, the air went still. Well, he's at the arena right now. Since our magic got that such a big boost, we should visit the alchemy tower. And we got some mine to kind of heal up the lot one we lost. Uh oh. I 
Ouch. I'm perfectly all right. This is this is what spiral power is like. Oh. Oh. Well, uh, I think this is actually pretty useful in the long run for survival, even if it is a massacre for everyone else. That's a win-win for me. And there goes our alchemy tower. <laughs> that seems like the gardens. Landscaping's pretty masculine. It'll help our uh, dueling skills. And, and actually, I don't think it actually does. Which is not surprising to me, anyway. This is the first time in this game I've done something good for someone and have been rewarded for it. And then the world was a howling fury, chaos, screaming, a sound of all we knew being pulled in half. Week four. Well, we're super magic, so, uh,. I guess we'll go to the palace. Hopefully no accidents happen and everyone's heads blow up. Sure, juggling will go good with my magic. Wow. Now we're poor, though. You spend the week being Batman. By being Batman, you gain one mind, physique, and finesse. But by being Batman, you also lose your parents. It's quite a tragic event. No time for you. I've got Batman things to do. When it arrives this time, how will we fare? Will we once more rebuild? Move on? Be strong? Or have we forgotten? She's doing pretty well for herself. Her mind's pretty low, but all her stats are doing pretty good. Hmm. Maybe having two mind wasn't good in defending myself in court. Oh. Well, that's an interesting stat spread right now. Let's take you to the palace. These dancing skills will be handy. Always the best of stats. Peasant, do you know who you speak to? I'm in fact a medieval Batman. Passive aggressive response sounds smart, but active aggressive sounds cool, so we'll go with that. You gain 
The Ark, it's almost here. Almost. Almost. I have no idea what I gained, but... I don't know. I need to improve my mind. Drinking. I have no money. But I did get mine for skipping out, so we're not completely nuts, but we're getting pretty close. Hmm. Better chop some wood. The storm arrives in the night, but in the morning it still rages. For three full days, a tempest puts us through a grinder, drowns us, crushes us, ruins us. But then it ends. We see the graveyard our home has become. Our home. Does anything yet live? Is it? Are we past saving? So... The Yogg is a hurricane, apparently. Charm 10, Magic 13. That, all those stats pretty nice for mine. We're definitely a conjurer. But it looks like we failed. <laughs> oh my god. Well, this, this worked out for us, but not for everyone else. We'll need a hero to save the town from these demons. It looks like you have to be it. But too bad, he looks like you're bad at it too. If only you were more charming. And so, we set about our tasks, once more living our lives. This time in a way we might never have expected, or even wanted, but in the end... We were defeated. Those of us left struggled to put our home to rights, but the effort was futile, doomed. The city bled survivors, eventually becoming a husk, a dead thing, and perhaps a Yogg was only partly to blame. I think the demon army was probably the biggest thing that screwed over this town. I don't teach all these kids to make fun of my dart skill. That looks pretty nice for being demonic. Like, we have some nice sunshine, we have a nice village, we had some nice birds, almost Disney-like. So it worked out for her. And our friend became a drug addict bodyguard. Oh, he became the Hulk, essentially. A very weak inside Hulk. Things didn't go too well for our one hero. But our other one became the Demon King and lived happily ever after. And created a new demon civilization. So it worked out in the long run. Not for humanity, but, you know, for demons. So anyway, that's it for this preview of the Yogg. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys later.